Hi everyone, so I'm back with another journal. Um, I was going to do a tab bound journal and completely change my mind this morning. I know I would. Um, so I'm still I'm using up stuff that's already printed off, not really scraps, but I'm just trying to use up all the bits and bobs. So I have uh, made this uh, tall, skinny journal. Um, made quite a few of these. I love the big, tall, skinny journals. Um, this one here measures nine and three quarters in length, four and a quarter width, one signature, 48 pages front and back. Will be listed in my shop and I have 20% off until the end of uh, tomorrow. Today, tomorrow, depends on what time this gets up, the 7th of April, okay? Um, so here I have used Artie Maze's, Artie Maze's, Artie Maze's new, new freebie kit over on our coffee shop and some of her blue collage kit, I think that's what it's called, um, to make that, so I've kind of inter, intermixed the two. Uh, here uh, I've actually used some of the French blue kit from Artie Maze as well and then just bits and pieces that I've pulled out from everything that's already printed. So here, this I think this is from the French Blue. Um, this is some, um, I don't know, I think it's our Artie Maze, but I can't remember the name of the kit. Some Edith Holden. There is a library card behind here. It's got shades of green because there is green, um, even though there's a lot of blue in this, there is little hints of green here and there. Uh, and this lady is a Pinterest find from years ago, little butterfly there and a little label here from the old design shop. The word is from Artie Maze, that is from one of the Builder Cluster kits. Um, here I've got some, I made these up with my full memo and I just stuck that onto playing cards, little bits. I think it's when I made the frames the other week and the bits out the middle so I kept them and then I've used them so they're quite sturdy. Uh, on some bulb pins there. It's been stitched all around the edge. Um, I'm going to show some other journals at the end uh, that are for sale with 20% off uh, and I've kind of reduced them down to as much as I possibly can. Um, so and again that will be uh, that will end tomorrow so if you want to it's like you want to grab a bargain so i'm just checking that i'm in frame here yes because these big tall ones are quite hard to get in so this is packaging paper and uh this is artie maze's freebie kit which is absolutely beautiful um here we've got a printed uh did i print them smaller i must have done uh to make obviously little flips there here we have uh this is actually um, I used a few things out of one of my Creative Studio box. Um, I'm just going to grab all them little bits so that they're here to the side. <coughs> Excuse me. So I used some of these. Uh, they are on top of something on the back. That is the, the number on them. It's paper ephemera. They're like, um, where's my ruler? Where is my ruler? They are six by uh, two and three quarters. Um, I don't know how many's in there. I think there's maybe about 10, 12 of them. So I used four of them and you'll see them as I go through. So I'm just gonna set that up there at the way. So I've decorated that with labels from Tracy Fox and Edith Holden, Artie May's Polaroid uh, portraits and the word reflect. Then here, this is some Artie May's. I believe this is a freebie as well from previous months and uh, it was like collage papers so I have just chopped them up and made tags and then this is from Bohemian Crafting it's just some uh, like invoicey henna papers and then that all goes in there and then the little half page these little uh, tabs again are from uh, your creative studio and that's I don't know if you can see that Called journal tabs and that is DC0001 just in case that's how you got to find them on the website <laughs> uh, these little stickers I've only got a few left they're so pretty I like the shades of blue and kind of lilac -y colors in there because it went really well with um, the, the papers from Artie Maze you can see 
um, colours there. Uh, this is that paper is from Bohemian Crafting. They just made some simple tags here. And we've got some tabs there. This is uh, tailor made journals and another little sticker down there. We have that says memories, and on the back is just some floral paper. Uh, that was just some scrap pieces from one of Artemisia's uh, papers. So this is one of the collage strips. I've got a video on how I made them rather than buying them, make my own. But I cheated with this one. I actually used some collage paper from Artemisia and then just built on the top and just left bits like here and here and there and at the top and down the bottom. And I just decorated it. I might do a quick video on that over the weekend. Um, got a busy day Saturday because it's the grandson's first birthday party and I'm doing food for the party um, so I'm going to be busy Saturday um, so hopefully I'll get some crafting done over the weekend that is a freebie from Artie Mays I think that might have been last month can't remember, I really can't remember this is from these from uh, your creative studio and let me show you where that is, if it's in this box or not. Maybe not, I think it's from another box. <coughs> I think. But it's a really big thick pad. And I just tore out a few, which clearly I forgot to use some of them. I think that was the only one I used. Um, so I'll leave them out and I'll kind of use them and other, other things. So that was them. Um, yeah, so that's the collage strips and lace trim somewhere to write. Another page from Artie Mays. Another little pocket here. Um, another tag from the papers from your creative studio. And Artie Mays, Tracy Fox, Artie Mays, Edith Holden. Little word there. A little wordy word. And that is from the French Blue kit from Artie Mays. And then this is from the old design shop. This is one of the papers from the freebie from Artie Mays, and then that's one of the little tabs. This little booklet, I did use, I don't know where I used that, did I use it? It must have been on the other collage uh, strip. These are really cute. I'm going to keep them out, because I keep everything in the boxes, and then I forget about them, so I'm going to start keeping things out so that I use them. Um, a little sticker on the tab, Bohemian Crafting, another little tag there. <coughs> I thought my voice is just going and going, it's just so dry. So a little tab there, it says create on there. And then a little pocket uh, with a butterfly and labels and, and words. This is actually from uh, Lace Boutique 1, that's Anna's shop. Um, and I was going through looking for stuff and I... Like I'd forgot her file was on my computer and I looked and I was like ah I'll use them because it's got blue and the lovely florals so I don't know what kit it's from so I do apologise um, little tag that I made from some collage paper and then this is from tailor made journals so that is just in the back there Some lace trim, lots of writing space, and another pocket here. That's another one of these from uh, Lace Boutique One on Etsy, and that is another little collage tag. This is a freebie from Artie Mays. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> but she haven't spoke to anyone for hours. I think that's what it is as well. Uh, everybody's out. Home alone. Um, little tag, little flip, little sticker on there. Them stickers are really cute. And I put another little sticker there as well. And that goes on up there. Little tab there from your creative studio. Another little tag. And this one here. And then some more. I think this is from Artie Mays. Her French ephemera kit, the second one. And that goes in there. Another little sticker there. I'm actually getting into stickers at the moment, like florals and butterflies and things. 
yeah that was from that little pack there from your creative studio um, you get all them in there little like botanicals it's not the greatest flip through but um, I don't think I've got a have I got a playlist of your creative studio I think I do another big tag to journal on some French camera from the old design shop I did have to take a bit off the top because it wouldn't fit in here so that goes in there and then again I've just used Artie Maze's collage paper and then just built on the top of it so you still see bits of the paper and then that little thing there little tab that says inspire another tag here little sticker little tab there love the blues I really do like the blues um, another one of these from your creative studio just all layered up again this is uh, Artie Mays that's a freebie I no it's not it's from the French blue kit this is from uh, French ephemera kit and that goes in there and then that is the back so that is that journal um, and like I said, I'm going to show you in a minute and I'll just, I'll, I'm not going to talk in the other ones because I have already done videos. I'm just going to show um, a quick flip of the other journals that are for sale. Um, I hope you like this one. If you have any questions about this one, then ask below. Um, yep, so I'm just going to quickly show you the other ones. So this is a journal called Embrace and uh, that is that there and I'm just going to do a quick flip of this 20% off ends of the 7th of April All the details for this is on the listing which you will find below in the description box I'm just going to do a quick flip of this one as well that below I'm just going to do a quick flip of this one as well 20% off until the 7th of April which is tomorrow today tomorrow depending on what time this video goes out mm -hmm. 